Magic Nation here, and I caught Dr. Baker. Don't chew on my break. I'm a pirate, stealing my booty. Walk the plank, walk the plank. Ooh. these shores. You never know what the rumbling waters and the seas are going to bring to you. Am I right, matey? Huh. What'd you say? Why is Miss Leslie have that voice and that hook on her hand? Well, you guessed it. We are doing pirates! People see your voice. We're going to do Pirates! The art of being a pirate. Did you get that? The art of being a pirate. Of being a pirate. So today, before we set sail for our booty, we are going to learn how to be a correct and proper pirate. Now you say, how do you do that? Well, I don't know. I've been on the sea for so long that these crowns look like snacks to me but I won't eat these crowns. But I will show you guys how to make your own hook for a hand. And also, like most pirates dream and set sail, they want to find the booty, the treasure. So we are gonna learn how to make our own very pirate maps, pirate hooks, and go for our very own pirate treasure. Are you ready? Let's do this. Oosh, oosh, oosh. The sails and the seas are bumpy, 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 bumpy. We're trying to get a steady, steady camera here. Are we good? Dr. Baker is angry about me making her walk the plank. Dr. Baker and I have been collecting these coins and my hook and doing treasure maps. Dr. Beaker, what do you think about this treasure map? So Dr. Beaker actually helped me make this treasure map. So what we're getting ready to do is discover how we make our own very treasure map. So the first thing you're going to need to do, what kind of treasure you want? Let me down. Walk that plank, Beaker. Oh, walk that plank. You ready to go below deck? We're going below deck to get supplies. We'll be back. The sea's winds are crazy today, but we are going to learn how to make your own pirate hook and go searching for your own pirate treasure, treasure. So the first thing's first. Where do we hide all of our booty? So we need to think about what our map is going to look like. So I started my map last night on this piece of construction paper. Cameraman, can you zoom? Mm. So my pirate map, if you notice, I still have an unfinished edge down here. So what I took was a piece of brown construction paper. It doesn't need to be brown if you have white or any other paper, we'll start from there. So I'll start how I started hiding my pirate treasure with my map. I grabbed my brown, brown piece of construction paper and I did what? Crumple it. Tear it up. You're right. First ball it up because you're creating texture. Because like a pirate, it's age. So once you get a good ball, mm, mm, ah, ooh, ah, ooh, ah, they were good. So after you unball it, you see you get this nice wrinkled texture. You get these nice straight edges, no longer straight, and they're tiny rips. You rip it. Boop, boop, boop.
crinkle it back up, and open it. Now, if that doesn't look old, I don't know what does. So I'm gonna invite Mr. Zeke, our cameraman, to come closer to show you a different technique to make it even look older. Come closer, come closer, come closer, come closer, come closer. With come closer, come closer. It's too close, back up, back up, back up. Ooh. Hmm. That look okay now? Don't look okay? I do? Okay. So, now, if you've got a black crown, see these wrinkles? I'm just gonna add a little bit. Just, just a wee bit. Just especially around these edges here. All the way around. Oh, this one's not quite. Just make sure we add a little bit of dark crown. Now, if you don't have a crown, even a pencil, Looking pretty age. So now we do it again. Prickle it again. Now we're gonna open it back up. Now we've got this nice, and you'll start to notice you got a nice, almost like leather feeling material. So now that we've got the base of our map, where is our treasure gonna be hidden? If I'm not correct, X marks the spot. But there's a lot of journey on the way to finding the treasure. Am I right, the cameraman? Okay, he's agreeing with me, which I like. So, if you notice on my map, zoom in here. We have the Blue Blob Lagoon. We have the Haunted Ship. We have the Dragon's Eye Cave, before which X marked the spot. So, where is your treasure gonna be hidden? I want you to take this time, if you've got a blank piece of paper, Look at your backyard, your house, or even your bedroom and figure out what obstacles are gonna be the path to find your treasure. So, what I start out with usually, naturally, is I'm gonna lay my paper down. Cameraman, come closer. So, is, I use a black crown and the dash line is the path they will follow to find your treasure. So, I'm gonna circle here. What's that gonna be? And then they'll go here. What's that gonna be? Then they'll go here. What's that gonna be? And then they can travel everywhere around there until X marks the spot. Until X marks the spot. Where is your treasure gonna end up for people to find? What is your treasure map gonna look like? So think about that. Brainstorm. What is your booty treasure pirate treasure map gonna look like? Now, stop, thank you. Again, I'm feeling a lot of creative energy coming through, like a lot of brainstorming. So I'm going to put on my brainstorming cap, go below deck while you guys think about what your treasure map and where it's going to lead to. Ugh, the rocky seas. I'm going below deck. <laughs> to be or not to be a pirate. I hope your brainstorming session went well with your treasure map. Don't share your secrets with me. But to be a pirate, you know, have a boat, sure. But to have a hook for a hand, you definitely are a pirate. I'm gonna pick my teeth. Is, a, is everything on my teeth, cameraman? Oh, my teeth are clean, thank God. So, if you got a paper cup, 
or you can make one out of construction paper because you're smart and you're part of my imagination. So what I did, I took some household foil, just a small piece. What you're gonna do is you're gonna crinkle it up just like the pirate treasure map. Ooh, that hook is very large. But you're gonna take the, the top of this, have your people with scissors or with a pencil, and I'm just going to poke Just a little bit hole. Like that. Take with this. And I'm gonna stick it. And see, it's coming through. That's big! So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fold it inside the cup to create some stability. Then you got a hook for a hand! Now you're a pirate, ready for a journey. So, Dr. Baker and I are going to work for our own treasure. Where is your treasure going to lead us? Where is your map going to take us? We're kind of tired. We're going to retire. But, to all of our mad, my Magic Nation pirates, we can't wait to see what kind of booty you guys come up with.